Hey guys, welcome back to Medical Minion. This is video 4 for Physiology where I'm going to talk about homeostasis. So let's get started. Firstly, I would like to give you some example of homeostasis so it can help you build your concept faster. Body temperature control in humans is one of the most familiar example of homeostasis. A healthy human being maintains a temperature close to 98.6 degrees Fahrenheit, that is 37 degrees Celsius. But number of factors affect this value. The factor includes the exposure of elements, hormones, metabolic rate and diseases leading to exclusively a high or low body temperature. The hypothalamus in the brain regulates body temperature and feedback about temperature from body is carried out through bloodstream to the brain which results in complementary adjustment to return the body temperature to the normal. We'll talk this phenomena in upcoming videos. So the basic example I want to say is when you get shiver in the cold or sweats in the summer, that's your body trying to maintain homeostasis. That is temperature of your body close to 98.6 degree Fahrenheit or 37 degree Celsius. Now you have a basic idea of what exactly homeostasis is. This was the example of thermoregulation and we are very familiar with it as we are talking about the temperature. But there are various other examples of homeostasis like osmoregulation which is the process of maintaining a constant osmotic pressure inside the body by balancing concentration of fluids and salt. Other example is chemical regulation which is the process of balancing concentration of chemicals like glucose, carbon dioxide in the body by producing hormones. We'll talk about this type of regulation in upcoming video. This was all for this video. In the upcoming videos, we'll talk about the definition, regulations and type of feedbacks. Do follow me on Instagram at the red medical minion. Links are in the description. Hit the like button if you like the video. Subscribe to my channel. And thank you for watching.